Flax, a micro web framework that allows developers to build web applications quickly and efficiently in Python. Flax provides a minimalistic approach to web development, focusing on the core functionalities required to build web applications without imposing unnecessary complexity. It follows the MVC architectural pattern where the model represents the data and logic and the views handle the user interface and the controller manages the flow of information between the model and the view. Flax has quite a huge ecosystem of modules for almost anything like logging, sessions, authentications and more which can make your S framework jealous. Create a, a new file in your app directory that ends in .py. Add this piece of code. In the code snippets above, we import the Flax module and create an instance of the class of the Flax class to let Flax know the location of the application's resources. Next, you can define routes in your application. Routes determine the URL patterns that your application will respond to and the functions that will define those requests. After that, Flax also allows you to render HTML templates to generate dynamic web pages. You can use engines like Jinja2 to combine both HTML and dynamic data from your application. Add this code and then decode the render template function takes in the name of the template file profile.html as an argument and any additional variables you want to pass to the template. The template file includes placeholders that will be replaced with the actual values when the page is rendered. Overall, Flux is pretty bad as a creating small yes minimalistic Python apps in Python. This is Flux in 100 seconds. Thanks for watching. Subscribe and I will see you all in the next one.